Takashi Delek, everyone. I am Sifu, leader of the Tibetan monks. Though we used to be a simple monkey tribe, once known for our playfulness amongst the tall trees, now we are somehow renowned for our wisdom. I'm sure you know by now that my tribe must have either been careless or thoughtful enough when it came to the contaminated waters of our region. For this land, Fuki, is more than just our dwelling. It is our heart, our sanctuary, and it shall forever remain so. What is it to stand apart, to be different, to not blend seamlessly into the world around you, yet still be revered by your people as someone of absolute worth? It is a truth we all face. And now, I ask you, what is considered wealth in your eyes? Is it the ease of gold and silver pressed into your hands? Or is it the wisdom earned, the kind that fuels your growth, guiding you to obtain what your spirit truly seeks? Each of us must choose what we value, for no one can tell you when to rest or when to lay down the burdens of your world. We carve out time for toil, for family, for self-reflection. But know this, art, my friend, art is the soul's preservation. It is the song that carries us through the storm, the legacy that withstands the winds of time. Without it, we are but dust, scattered and forgotten. I invite you, yes, you, to find that spark within your heart and then extend an invitation to others into that sacred space. A world of fulfillment awaits those brave enough to open their hearts, to share in the dance of creation and discovery. This, my friends, is the path that replenishes the weary and ignites the spirit for new beginnings. Understand, we are a peaceful clan. We toil and train in our art, welcoming the curious and the kind into our realm for private glimpses into our way of life. There is always more to learn, just as there is always more to teach. So I ask you now, will you come as the student or perhaps as the teacher? Whatever your answer, I assure you, you shall return. For this place calls to all who seek the answers. Fuki is open.